What's up? Welcome back to the Fit Fan Club. It's Monday morning. Just got back from my town. And I'm freaking tired. I am like stupid tired. Um, I know it's been a while since you heard from me, but you know, I'm back now. And I'm about to get back on it. So bear with me. But yeah. I'm about to make some coffee, some keto coffee at that, so I'll show you that here in a minute. Before I get that coffee going, I want to show y'all this. Yeah, uh, like I said, I know we ain't really been, well, I haven't been really shooting for real, recording or making videos, posting videos. I've been recording, but I ain't just been, I just ain't been posting and editing. And I just be trying to figure out like, which direction I want to go. You know uh, how I want to structure my videos, but you know what? I'm just gonna record, slap that shit together, and post it up like to keep me accountable. Like that's what this channel was for, anyway, just to hold me accountable. So, so uh, talking about holding me accountable with a segue, this is what we have here. Forgive the toy. But yeah, so I got my treadmill, got the elliptical, and I got a couple new things that the wife decided to, you know, jump on the bandwagon and help me out. So she has, boom, got me a calendar, which is like a visual reinforcement to make sure I stay on my, on my shit. So now I can write in. As you see, I've been out of town, so I ain't been writing nothing in. But yeah, I have a calendar. She has her own calendar also, because she wants to get on it. You know, we're trying to do this thing as a team now. And she went on her Pinterest thing, her pen, Pinterest, and she got <laughs> marbles and jars. So as you see, that's how much weight I want to lose. I'm not gonna say how many marbles in there yet. Fuck it, it's about a hundred. Um, and that's her marbles. And every morning, when I weigh in here, sorry about that. And if I lose weight, I take money. I mean, I take marbles out of the the uh, current weight jar and put them into the lost jar. And hopefully I don't have to take any more out of the lost jar, put them back into the gang jar. But yeah, that's something that... You know, she seen on Pinterest and decided to, well, we both kind of seen it and we decided to run with it. Just as some motivation just to keep us going. And like I said, I got my, my, uh, cardio machines here. I have, I don't know if you can see that. I got my little ab roller wheel there. Some perfect push-ups. I want to get some dumbbells too because I kind of got to, I want to start like working out more than one time a day. You know, my, I want to work out more than one time a day to get this thing going. You know, I want to really get it going. Sorry about the light. But yeah, got the office here. Got everything I need to really get focused on the, the channel. Got my computer. I got a laptop. I got everything I need to, to really get it going. So. I woke up this morning super tired, but super motivated. So, to the keto coffee. tablespoon of Kerrygold butter, one tablespoon of uh, coconut oil, and I'm going to do probably one tablespoon of heavy whipping cream. Just hit it with a light blend like that, and boom, you're ready. So really... This coffee contains about 250 to 300 calories. So, therefore, 
this is basically a meal in itself. This is my breakfast. Because as you see, I'm, as you know, I'm trying to lose weight. So this is my breakfast. And it gets my fats. It's a good source of fats. I'm damn near getting probably 25 grams of fat, if not more. 14, 35 to 40 grams of fat. So there we go. So, on the way to the store to make turkey, get stuff to make turkey chili, and get some other stuff that we need because we kind of run low on groceries. The wife says she wants turkey chili, so this is basically my break from work. I work from home, and I'm be, uh, I guess I'll take you guys along with me. Yep. All right, so before I go to the grocery store, you know you can't ever go to the grocery store hungry. So I had to stop and get something. Now I tried to stop at the China spot over here. I don't know if you can see it. Let me see if I can zoom in. Damn, you can't zoom in. What the fuck? Now I tried to stop at the China spot over there, but they were closed on a Monday. I don't know what time is it. That's crazy. When you forget your phone, you just don't know nothing. Like, my, my radio clock ain't set right, I don't think. But, yeah, so I tried to stop there, but I couldn't, so I had to stop here. Sonic. <laughs> what I got here is just a bunless burger. A bunless double burger. And, um, that's pretty much it, you know. And a bottle of water. So I'm gonna eat this real fast and I'm gonna go in this grocery store so I can get what I need and head back home. Okay, I'm back from the grocery store. Sorry I ain't uh, turned on the camera in the grocery store. For one, it's kind of weird because I'm still new at YouTube. To pull out your camera in public at the grocery store and talk to it. And number two, I didn't really make a list. So I was kind of freestyling in there so I wasn't really focused. So next time I go in there, I will make a list and do all that good shit. But um, basically, I'm making turkey chili. Uh, I do the pre-cooked beans, I mean pre-made beans in the in the can. Uh, I got that mixture right there. I'm going just heating up. I'm gonna add some more beans to it. But that is basically peppers, onions. It's basically that. Got peppers, bread and uh, green peppers and onions. And I also have, um, I do basically some more onions. I do that. Pico from Kroger. Shit. Jalapeno, cilantro, onion, tomatoes. So that's a mixture of both of those. And then, I'm go ahead. it's going to be turkey chili. So... I got the turkey and that's like I just this is my first time getting this like they come in packets they come in three packets three one pound packets so I'm using two pounds which is two of these I thought that was interesting so I'm showing you guys so I'm gonna keep on what the fuck is that? my bad I'm gonna keep on cooking this and I'm gonna show you how to finish product Throw photos in there. Get that mixed up. And I'll be back to show y'all how that looks when it's cooked up. So as I'm cooking, I'm having a little keto snack. Some cheese and salami. Salami. Spicy salami is really good actually. But the sodium is really high, so got my water going too. Okay, so uh, the turkey is pretty much done. Be aware that if you're not used to cooking ground turkey, you might want to add that um, chili seasoning later because you're not going to be able to tell by color if, it, if the turkey is done or not. But since I've been doing it for a while, I know the consistency and I can break it open, I can look. But yeah. 
Anyway, this is how the turkey look. It almost looks like hamburger meat with the chili powder. So I'm going to go ahead and add that to my mixture over here, still heating up. And I'll show you how. Alright, this is the finished product. I added some. I added half an avocado, uh, about a dollop and a half of sour cream, and half a cup of cheese. Shredded, <coughs> shredded um, mild cheddar. So, that's dinner.